Page. He's from St. Petersburg, and it was in the men's technical program that he first made a strong impression on all of us. The technical program is full of required elements, but none more important than this combination, a triple axle and a double toe loop. Oleg Kataurov was not a member of the Soviet team at the Olympics in Albertville. He was a fourth place finisher in the Soviet championship. Behind Ermanov, Zagrodnyuk, and Viktor Petrenko, the ultimate gold medal winner. But certainly a candidate for the Russian team in Lillehammer. And watch this next jump, this triple loop. Look at the size and the distance. Spectacular. Oleg Tatarov, second in the men's standings after the technical program. Canadian Elvis Stoiko, third in the world in 1992 and the favorite in Victoria, is anything but a typical skater. He's known for his strength. That's why I never was into learning ballet, because it's not me. And that's not where, where, where I'm at. I'm more of the, how can I say, of course, you can be powerful in ballet, but I'm not. I'm more the try to be the macho kind of guy. That's that's the way I am. I ride dirt bikes and do martial arts, and that's the sort of idea I'm trying to portray on the ice. Yes, he was named for the king, and he's become king of the ice in Canada, Scott. Well, he's definitely going to give Kurt Browning a run for his money. Nobody trains harder than Elvis Stoiko, superstar of the future. And the leader after the technical program. Scott Davis, born and raised in Great Falls, Montana, now trains in Colorado Springs, Colorado, an alternate to our United States Olympic team a year ago and another rising star in the sport. Another great athlete who works very hard. I've had the opportunity of skating a lot with Scott Davis this summer. Great athlete, works very hard. But this double axle in the technical program cost him anything higher than third place. An easy jump for him, silly mistake. So Elvis Stoiko is the leader after the technical program. Oleg Tataurov, the real surprise of the competition thus far, is in second. And Scott Davis is third. Coming up, the men's free skate on Olympic Winterfest. <laughs>